Hey, what's going on YouTube? Tomasa A here um, with reasons on why you shouldn't buy an iPhone 3GS if you already have a regular iPhone 3G or a regular 2G iPhone. Now, you might be thinking, oh, why? Why wouldn't I want to get an iPhone 3GS? Well, let me put it this way. The iPhone 3GS is basically the same thing as the iPhone 3G. The only thing that has a video recorder and out of focus, that's basically it. Nothing else, of course, a uh, faster processor, but I'm not sure that will even make a difference. So first of all, this only goes to jailbroken iPhone um, customers only. If you have a jailbroken iPhone, um, this video is for you. But if you do not have a jailbroken iPhone or whatever, just, just turn away from the video because this is not for you. Well, basically, like I said, the iPhone 3GS has video recording. Now, can you get video recording on, uh, on an iPhone 3G or a regular 2G iPhone? Yes, of course you can. Um, um, if you want to know how, look at my video called How to Record Video with Your iPhone iPod Touch. It's called Sidecorder. You can get that at Cydia. I do have a video on this, and make sure you go check it out. Once again, it's called How to Record. Now, of course, the iPhone 3GS, the whole, the whole gimmick of the iPhone 3GS is the whole video recording thing. And if you have a jailbroken iPhone 3G or regular iPhone, doesn't matter which one, you're going to be able to record as long as it's jailbroken. And every single iPhone right now that's out, it's, it's capable of getting jailbroken. All of them. If you want to jailbreak your iPhone up a touch, look at my video called How to Jailbreak Your iPhone Up a Touch. So once again, why would I spend more money on something that I already have? I already have an iPhone that's capable of recording video. Now, um, the iPhone 3GS does um, has 3G. The iPhone 3G has 3G. I mean, come on, that's a no-brainer. Um, basically, the only thing that we're missing that so far hasn't been, well, at least I haven't heard of it yet, but it's out of focus. Our camera does not have autofocus. Well, the jailbroken iPhone 3G and regular 2G iPhone does not have autofocus, but that's not really a big deal. Who the hell was autofocus? Just whatever. It's, it's not worth a hundred dollars more, or well, excuse me, three hundred, four hundred dollars more. It's not worth it. It really isn't. So, okay, I'm not gonna get an iPhone 3GS. Well, I prob I probably will once the jailbreak comes out, which I give it about a month. But I'm just going to get it to make reviews and whatnot because it's what I do. I mean, you know. So, yeah, um, if you don't want to spend a, if you don't want to spend the money on an iPhone 3GS, don't. Just jailbreak your regular iPhone and you it'll literally be the same thing because the iPhone 3GS and the iPhone 3G look exactly the same. The design is, is, a, is identical. I mean, if you don't believe me, check out the pictures and be like, what the fudge? I mean, you know, the, the exact same thing. So yeah, the, 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 the whole game is just recording video, and you can't record video on an iPhone 3G or regular iPhone, so that's it, people. What more do you want me to tell you? Um, do you want to waste your money for like something that you could have already? Just all it takes a couple of minutes of your time? Hey, that's up to you, but this is my opinion. Of course, I will get an iPhone 3GS, but you know, like, if you had the money, but you sort of need it, don't buy it. I mean, I have the... I, I'm just gonna buy it for the hell of it, but it's because I get paid basically for working out as a marine, you know. Um, so yeah, I'm I'm gonna buy it, but I don't re I don't recommend people that already have a jailbroken iPhone 3G to buy because it it will not. There isn't a difference. I mean, I'm gonna buy it later on when AT and T decides to give me the free upgrade or whatever because uh, unfortunately AT and T is bitching about current iPhone 3G owners not being eligible for the 199 and 299 price. So yeah, people, just I mean. Kids, children, whatever, don't hassle your parents over the iPhone 3GS if you already have an iPhone 3G. Just unlock it, people. I mean, look how cool my iPhone looks, packed with themes and whatnot. Just hold, hold on, all right? Now, if it were to have 4G, which it doesn't, then okay, it'll be a different story. But the iPhone 3GS is basically it's a twin of the iPhone 3G. It's a fraternal, whatever that means. It's, you know, don't waste your money, right, people? The economy is already bad. Oh, well. We do need to buy to stimulate the economy, but buy a MacBook or something. If you want to help Apple, buy a MacBook. But by buying the iPhone 3GS, you're, you're helping AT&T now. Of course, I have something against AT&T for this whole thing of not subsidizing the iPhone or whatever. But yeah, th this is my opinion. If you want to go ahead and buy an iPhone 3GS, hey, that's you know your problem. I'm just telling you that it's, it really isn't worth it. It is not worth it. So there you go, YouTube. 10 master 8. Make sure you subscribe, comment, rate. 10 master 8, out. Thank you.